Hello, smart learners. Today you will learn about design rationale in HCI with the help of examples. So the question here is that what is design rationale and how to present it? So the answer to this question is it is all about answering by and sometimes you have to explain what and how specifically why you make a design decision. So Communication skills are often ranked high among a UX designer's skills and qualifications. Therefore, a UX designer should communicate a story to connect her design decisions with reasons, facts, thoughts, and arguments instead of merely presenting wireframes or prototypes. So according to Wikipedia, a design rationale is an explicit documentation of the reasons behind decisions made when designing a system or artifacts such as an object. For example, it includes descriptive form of detail that why you made a decisions for designing a system or an object. A decision design can be as big as organizing the web page layout like this or creating a user flow like this or as small as picking colors of the fonts. There are two types of design rationale. First one is process oriented design rationale, which is IVIS, and second one is structure oriented design rationale, which is QOC. I've already discussed both of these approaches and types of design rationale in my previous videos. I've also given the link of these two videos in the description box. You can check it out for further explanation. So you might be thinking about one question that why we are using design rationale? What's the purpose of using it? So basically design rationale helps ensure that UX designers are being intentional with all of their actions and decisions which can further increase the potential of product success. Secondly, it also aims to convince team members such as project managers, developers, other designers, stakeholders and clients. Therefore, it is often said that a good designer must be a good communicator. So that was all from my side for design rationale. I hope you understand the concept of design rationale now. Thank you so much for watching the video.